These are the guys from 2nd Ranger Battalion that have lost since the global war on terrorism has started. Sergeant First Class Leroy Pichu was part of the 2nd Battalion 75th Ranger Regiment when they were sent out on a mission. The mission was to Paktia Province, Afghanistan to capture a high-value target. Upon access to the primary building, they took on strong enemy fire. 2008, May 26th, I was uh, part of a daylight raid with uh, 2nd Ranger Battalion. I was shot through both my legs and then I picked up a hand grenade that was uh, near my ranger buddies and attempted to throw it away and as I opened my hand it exploded and amputated my hand. Because of his actions on the battlefield, Petrie was awarded the Medal of Honor. I had the, the distinct honor of being in the White House when, when he did in fact uh, receive the medal from President Obama. It's a, uh, it's a very humbling experience. Uh, nobody ever goes out to be awarded the Medal of Honor, but uh, I tell people that it, it's, it's a rare award that not many people get it that are still living, and so a, a lot of recipients will say it's a heavy award to wear. It makes it lighter for me to share it with others. And he continues to share it with others when he found out about Operation Proper Exit, a program that helps service members recovering from combat-related injuries come back to Afghanistan to find a little more closure and leave the battlefield on their own terms. They're all a great bunch of uh, guys, uh, some of them a little timid at first, uh, not really interacting that well until they got to know us and everyone's starting to come out of their shell and uh, we've become really close. Sergeant Petrie spent the next couple of days traveling with Operation Proper Exit throughout Afghanistan and sharing his stories with deployed service members. Petty Officer Omar Dominguez, Kabul, Afghanistan.